So earlier today, Nintendo filed a patent infringement lawsuit against Pocket Pairs, the creator of Pal World. For what patent specifically, it has not been disclosed. So we do not know. The current assumption is going to be the Pal Sphere kind of infringing on the Pokeball since they do the same function. Pirate Software was nice enough to go ahead and write down his assumption and as well as link the patterns. When I looked into the pattern, this is extremely concerning because this is not a pattern for a Pokeball. This is a pattern for creature capture. So essentially what that means and what this goes over is essentially if you throw an object at another object, the initial object can capture the other object and store it. It will then switch function and allow you to throw that object again and release the captured entity to perform a function. So this is essentially the system for open world creature capture. That's what Nintendo is filing a patent for and filing a lawsuit on. So any open world survival creature capture game would fall under infringement. This has nothing to do with Pocket Pair and Pal World at all. This is Nintendo trying to make sure that we do not get a good open world creature capture game. And why is that? Because Pokemon Legends Z to A, which is probably going to be a watered down version of Power World, is coming out here soon. And they want to make sure that the only one who's allowed to make an open world survival creature capture game is them. This is not a Pokemon versus Power World thing. This is a Nintendo wants to be the only people making an open world survival creature capture game. And if you don't understand how that's not good for the gaming industry in general, I don't know what to tell you. This would kill an infinite amount of games, even becoming games, if this lawsuit does go through. If, if, Nintendo is able to hold this patent and win a lawsuit for this, that means that there will never be any other open world survival creature capture game besides what Nintendo gives us. Because the patent is broad enough that it essentially just says object. It doesn't say ball. It doesn't say square. It doesn't say rhombus. It doesn't say card. It's for the concept of creature capture in general. And Stephen Trujillo has a pretty nice breakdown here, right? Where it kind of shows what the pattern goes over in the concept, where essentially your ability to use a capture object on something. So they're trying to pattern the concept. Well, I'm not, I guess not trying to because the pattern's already gone through in Japan, just not the US yet. But they're trying to pattern the concept of creature capture. So even in games like Ark, where there's those capture spheres that you can throw at dinosaurs, that would fall under copyright. I'm sorry, not under copyright, under patent infringement. So that mod would be taken down. Actually, now thinking of it, Ark would also fall under it because you have the ability of capturing and storing a creature. That's how big of a deal this is. This lawsuit can't be allowed to win. It doesn't matter if you like Pokemon. It doesn't matter if you like Power World. This is Nintendo trying to kill an entire genre of game. 